Hi, my name is Rajesh Pavitran and I am the CEO and founder of Boon Tech. Today, as part of the blockchain video series, we will talk about Decentralized Storage Platform or Swarm. Swarm is a decentralized storage platform and content distribution service for Ethereum. Swarm has been designed to serve as a decentralized and redundant store of Ethereum's public record and also to store and distribute DAP code. Swarm is a peer-to-peer -peer storage platform which is maintained by the peers who contribute their storage and bandwidth resources. Being a peer-to-peer -peer system, Swarm has no single point of failure and is resistant to false and distributed denial of service or DDoS attacks. Swarm is also censorship resistant as it is not controlled by any central authority. Swarm has a built-in incentive system for peers who pool in their storage and bandwidth resources. Decentralized Messaging Platform or Whisper Whisper is a communication protocol that allows decentralized application or dApps to communicate with each other. With Whisper, dApps can publish messages to each other. Whisper messages are transient in nature and have a time to live or TTL set. Each message has one or more topics associated with it. The dApps running on a node inform the node about the topics to which they want to subscribe. Whisper uses topic-based routing where the nodes advertise their topics of interest to their peers. Smart Contracts A smart contract is a piece of code that resides on a blockchain and is identified by a unique address. A smart contract includes a set of executable functions and state variables. The function code is executed when transactions are sent to the functions the transaction include input parameters which are required by the functions in the contract. Upon the execution of a function, the state variables in the, con in the contract change depending on the logic implemented in the function. Smart contracts can be written in various high-level languages such as Solidity or Python. Language-specific compilers for smart contracts such as Solidity or Serpent compilers are used to compile the contracts into bytecode. Once compiled, the contracts are uploaded to the blockchain network, which assigns a unique address to each contract. Any user on the blockchain network can trigger the functions in the contract by sending transaction to the contract. The contract code is executed on each node participating in the network as part of their verification of new blocks. Contracts deployed on a blockchain network can send messages to other contracts. A message contains the address of the sender, address of the recipient, value to transfer, and a data field which contains the input data to the recipient contract. The difference between a transaction and a message is that a message is produced by a contract while a transaction is produced by an EOA. Decentralized Application or DAPs A decentralized application or DAP is an applica application that uses smart contracts. DAPs provide a user-friendly interface to smart contracts. A cryptocurrency application is an example of a DAP that runs on a blockchain network. A decentralized application DAP comprises smart contracts and files for web user interface, front-end, HTML or JavaScript, stylesheet, etc. Building a DAP involves the following steps. Implement smart contracts in a high-level language. Compile the contracts with language-specific compilers to generate the contract binary. Deploy the contract on Ethereum blockchain network using Ethereum clients. Build web application that interact with smart contracts. Ethereum clients. Ethereum clients allow, use, allow us to set up an Ethereum node on our compu computer. An Ethereum client is like a Java virtual machine or JVM and allows us to run Ethereum programs. With an Ethereum, Ethereum client, we can participate in the Ethereum network and perform tasks such as creating accounts and contracts, sending Ether to other accounts, sending transactions to contracts, 
mining on Ethereum network, and other tax related to the Ethereum blockchain network. Graphical user interfaces. The MIST Ethereum wallet application provides a graphical user interface for performing tasks such as managing Ethereum accounts, sending Ether to other accounts, deploying contracts, sending transactions to contracts, and view viewing account transactions. Compilers. Ethereum provides various high-level languages for implementing contracts, including Solidity, which is similar to JavaScript, Serpent, which is similar to Python, and Lisp, like language, LLL, which is similar to assembly. DAP frameworks. DAP frameworks such as Truffle or Embark simplify the steps involved in the creation of DAPs. Web3 or JavaScript, Web3 JavaScript API. Web3 is a JavaScript API created by the Ethereum Foundation, which provides method for interacting with Ethereum platform. Web3 allows DAPs to work with the Ethereum network. JSON RPC. The Ethereum JSON RPC is a stateless and lightweight remote procedure call protocol that is used by Ethereum clients implemented in different programming languages to interact with an Ethereum node. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you like this video. If you like this video, please like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you very much. I will see you in the next video.